Okay, this is an old sign from the farm. Not sure how old it is. It might be as old as the 1940s. It might be from the 1950s. It might even be from the 60s. Not sure. So it was up there at the farm. It was on my old uh, garage port. And... Uh, we were tearing the garage port down, so I said to Neil, get that down for me, so I can uh, refix it up, sand it, stain it, varnish it. So the next thing I'm going to do is, it's all sanded, ready to go. Now I'm going to go out in the, um, the little shed that we have here, and I'm going to paint it. I think I'm not going to put any paint into the lettering. I want to keep that the same as it is plus it'll pill out anyway so it's looking pretty good you'll see before and after the difference once again this camera does not have motion stabilizer Okay, this is an old sign from the farm. Not sure how old it is. It might be as old as the 1940s. It might be from the 1950s. It might even be from the 60s. Not sure. So it was up there at the farm. It was on my old uh, garage port. And... Uh, we were tearing the garage port down, so I said to Neil, get that down for me, so I can uh, refix it up, sand it, stain it, varnish it. So the next thing I'm going to do is, it's all sanded, ready to go. Now I'm going to go out in the, um, the little shed that we have here, and I'm going to paint it. I think I'm not going to put any paint into the lettering. I want to keep that the same as it is. Plus it'll pill out anyway, so it's looking pretty good. You'll see before and after the difference. Once again, this camera does not have motion stabilizer. works for me I will call this side finished I coded it two times and I'm not going to redo it for another time but the other side I need to do one more time I only did it once the other side I only did one time I got like maybe one or two little runs whoop de doo one by the B, somewhere up there, because I was drying it sideways. Mm. No big deal. Probably dry away anyways. When it gets uh, when it gets dry, like in a couple of weeks, it'll probably be gone. What? What did you do with the brush? It's out in the shed. Did you wrap it up? Yep, it's all wrapped up. Wow. Yeah, I probably can use it one more time. Just put it in a baggie? It's in a baggie. Hmm? Hopefully. Hopefully it'll be good enough. Did you put it in a baggie? Okay, I did it. Painted it two times 
on the front and on the sides painted it only one time on the back well let's see how it dries being it's uh, satin I think that's only supposed to be uh, uh, roughly not real glossy we'll see what happens not sure I could see it starting to dry in some places and it's not shiny which is okay don't want it to be shiny. Real don't want it to be real shiny. Right, we'll see how it goes. This is the kind of thing that you leave outside so it doesn't have to be perfect. Here is our little metal shed. That's to block the sun from coming in from the west. What happens is the sun comes in and makes us really hot, like a tin can. There's my dad's propeller from his glass air when he crashed into a tree. Yep, that's what's left of it. The only thing that got broken when he hit the tree was the propeller. That's how strong that fiberglass was. That must have been the part that was down in the tree. 